Hi everyone. This is Lucy. Lucy, say hi. I'm gonna try to turn this around. Hi. Nope. <laughs> now she wants to be on it. Um, I just wanted to quickly ask the question about risks. Um, John and I were talking about me doing these videos every day this month. And one of the reasons why I decided to go for it is because it feels risky to me. And it's easier to not do it, to be perfectly honest. Um, what do I have to say? What do I have to offer? Why would anyone want to listen to me? Hi, John Harding. I see you. Um, and I'm doing them anyway. So again, feeling risky. Um, but I have to say, even after only five days, some of the responses, one, the relationships that I'm continuing to build, two, and then today I've gotten, <laughs> um, I've gotten um, private messages from some people who are responding to some of the things I'm asking about and sharing and asking for prayer requests. Y'all, totally worth it. I would get on here every day if I knew I would be able to be in contact with some of you that I haven't talked to in a while. Um, as a matter of fact, if you have a prayer request that you would uh, honor me with, um, share it. Send me a private message. Um, I will join you in prayer and uh, thinking about you, celebrating you, um, shoot morning with you, whatever it is that um, you've got going on in your life. So yeah, share prayer requests with me. Um, also, if we haven't talked in a while, let's chat. Um, I'm desperately, I don't know what it is, but I desperately feel this need to connect. And um, like, man, I wish I could go to coffee with each one of you. And again, I think that's kind of how I'm built. Like, I can walk into a room of people, but I also really love connecting with one-on-one. -on -one. And so, um, what feels risky to you? Um, what's a challenge that you went after? And did you succeed? Did you fail? What's a challenge that you were like, no, that one's not for me. Um, you know, to be perfectly honest, my husband and I are very different. He would never do this. Um, and it's not worth it for him. And I don't blame him. You know, I mean, everybody's different. So. Um, Interesting. I can see green in my glasses from the screen. Uh, anyway, so share with me. What are some risks um, that are worth it for you? And then what are some that aren't? And uh, I don't know. I mean, obviously, doing a Facebook Live isn't that risky for some people. It feels risky, though, because I'm putting myself out there and I'm doing it every day. So, yeah. So anyway, I am very grateful to all of you. I just put my hand up in the air because I talk with my hands. Very grateful, you can't even say it. Very grateful to all of you that have commented, that have private messaged me, that um, are reaching out and um, responding. So thank you for that. And those of you that aren't, no worries at all. Um, but I would love to hear from some of you if you um, have the time. And otherwise, um, yeah, you're not alone. And, uh, I know that sometimes we feel like we are. And so how can we better connect and uh, be in this crazy life we are in together? Um, real quick, this morning I had my senior Sunday and one of the traditions at West End is that each senior gets to ask for an adult to speak on their behalf. And we had 14 seniors this morning and um, 14 different people spoke on but they were half and I told them they had three minutes <laughs> That didn't work out so well. Some of them had it at three some of them were longer but the tapestry of story that was shared this morning and the um, Just the breadth of relationship and these these uh, seniors that are gonna go off to school that have um, this community back at West End and in their lives. Some of them know these adults from all sorts of different aspects of their life, they, but they're connected at church too. And uh, I was just struck. Um, one of the moms actually said something, I'm not going to say it well, but she basically said, the beginning of how we know who we are starts with our name and our parents and then the community that surrounds us. Um, and uh, that happens in our day-to-day -day lives, uh, who we are, but also our faith journey, um, how we trust ourselves, 
And so, uh, yeah, I like connecting with you guys. So thanks for being a part of my community and uh, share with me some risks or don't. Whatever works for you. It may feel too risky to share a risk, um, but I'd love to hear a risk you've taken. Um, did you move somewhere? Did you take a new job? Did you um, tell somebody the truth? Um, one big, huge risk I did in my life was hike the Appalachian Trail with my sister. And uh, I don't regret that one bit. Hard, hard, hard. Maybe one of the hardest things I've done in my life. But uh, she's my best friend. And uh, I'm going to be honest, we weren't as close beforehand and then after we were. So, risks. What you got? Comment. Let me know. Private message me. Share some prayer requests. Hope you guys are having a great Sunday evening. It just rained here and now I'm sitting on my back deck with my puppy. I'm going to share her again. She's wandering around and sniffing all the things. I can see her. Hey, Lucy. Lucy, come here. Come say hi. <laughs> She's coming to say hi. There you go. Y'all have a good evening.